Muhaja goes forward. And just just Tijari now for the UK Arabian Racing at Chelmsford City Racecourse. Maiden stakes. All in. They're off. Racing away, 10 furlongs in front of them in the Black Cat Muhaja, the first one to show as they work their way down the home straight the first time with the grey Abaya bar on his outside. Towards the inside in the black jacket, Zephyr El Zayn is a close-up third, followed by Dina Bint Crayon in a maroon jacket, who's racing on the inside of Thamarat in the noseband and cheek pieces. Out White Ajari in the striped cap taking quite a keen hold, but they're tightly grouped with a circuit to run. Muhaja is the leader, stepping up in trip this afternoon. At a steady tempo, Muhaja is the leader by a length further. A Bayrath bar in the red and white half jacket in second. Three lengths back to the pink cap of Thamarat in the cheap pieces in third as they make the turn towards the back straight. That one just coming off the bridle briefly. Trapped by Tajari in a striped cap. Then on the inside, Zephyr El Zaying and Dinar Bint Crayon at the back of the field as they head into the back straight. Just over five furlongs left to go. Muhaja is the leader by a half length. Further, a Bayrath bar to the outside in second. A length and a half to Thamarat, who's a close-up third on the inside of Tajari. And a bigger break developing now. Maybe six lengths back to Dean Bint Crayon. And another two and a half to Zephyr El Zayin. Five furlongs left to go, so they're at halfway. Muhaja in the black cap on the inside of a Bayrath bar as they go towards the far end of the back straight. A length clear from Tijari, who's on the outside of Thamarat, who again just having to be cajoled along briefly as they go past the four pole. And Abayar Athbar and David Turner strikes the front and begins to pull away at the moment as they make the run out of the back straight. So with three furlongs left to go, Abayar Athbar striking for home, three lengths clear ahead of Muhaju, who's pushed along in second. Tijari to the outside in third. Thamarat flat to the boards in fourth now, but beginning to try and make an effort as they make the turn back in. The leading quartet covered by no more than two and a half lengths. Abaya Athbar running a bit green off the turn. Leads by a half length ahead of Tajari. Thamarat to the outside every chance in third. And then Muhaja down the home straight. Tajari on the outside of Abaya Athbar. Three deep. Here comes Thamarat as Tajari just lugs to his left as they make the run now. Down to the final furlong, almost three in a line. Abaya Athbar on the right, Thamarat on the left. Tijari between horses. Thamarat has been humoured to the front with a half furlong to go. Leads by a half length from Tijari. Then Abaya Athbar racing up towards the line. Thamarat pushed out hands and heels. Brilliant ride from Pettis. Thamarat off the mark at the seventh attempt. Wins by just under a length. Tijari was second. Abaya Athbar third. Muhaja in fourth. A long way clear from Dina Bint Crayon and Zephyr El Zayin. First number six, Thamarat. Second number one, third number five. And the fourth place horse number two. So the full result of the UK Arabian Racing at CCR Maiden Stakes. First number six, Thamarat. Second number one, Tijari. Third, number five, Abiyah Athbar. And fourth, number two, Mahaja. The distance is three quarters of a length and two and a half lengths. Three quarters of a length and two and a half lengths. The winner's time, two minutes, 19.93 seconds. 2 minutes 19.93 seconds. Well, a lovely performance by number six. Thamarat does the business. It's the second one of the day for Philip Collington, the trainer, and his owner, Sheikh Hamdan. And a good performance. He had the first and second, Sheikh Hamdan. And Will Pettis increases his lead in the race to become champion jockey. The young pretender gives Thamarat a great ride. Come and join us in the winner's enclosure. Thamarat coming back. By the way, latest news on the uh, Premier Football, Manchester City 6, Huddersfield 1.